Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Factorio. And this is our New World series. And how is everybody doing? Make sure you grab your drink and your tasty treats. And off we go exploring what possibilities this game has to offer. <laughs> so, what's happening today? Well, I think we have the biters under control. It's not pulsing anywhere. So the next order of business is to secure oil deposits. Now, I'm gonna zoom in here a bit. Looks like there's a bunch right up here. And we have a bunch down here. So we have these bases here. And potentially all of these. And then here we just have these. So I think what we're gonna do is I'm going to come up here, probably erect a wall, put some, probably some your turrets all around, um, another radar unit if I can, and yeah, we're going to try and see what we can do. So let's try and position this radar unit somewhere that makes sense. I think we're going to place one up here in these trees. Let's see here. So the way I figure this out is you have your box around your guy and you can go one out and that will be the size of a radar unit like for for scanning area like how you see these ones here well these larger squares are basically from a radar unit so yeah that's pretty cool so I think we're gonna place it right about here it's the middle right here so what we do is we'll, pl we'll place this guy that's uh, pick this stuff up. Let's kind of destroy this. Okay, so we have this. So now we need to position our power in such a way. So I'm going to use a big power thing just to see how that works. Hmm, thing. I like how I'm, I'm describing these these items. <laughs> uh, it's so funny. Um, okay. So yeah, thing. <laughs> uh. I do have walls, do I not? Yes, I do have walls. So we need to put some turrets in place here. How, what kind? We want turrets in such a way where they would be hard to destroy, I think. I think that will be enough. There shouldn't be really be any attacks. And if you do this, this, and this, like so. Okay. Um, let us put in a light somewhere. Where do we want to put the light? Let's put the light right there, and then we can place a wall all around this. And all this wall does is just stops the biters from, I don't know, it's kind of like an early defense, right? I'm hoping that this stops any kind of perpetration of the base. <laughs> perpetration, that's so funny. Oh, the words I come up with, I tell ya. So let's see here. Might be more bricks. Yeah. Oh, I want to do that. Shift 4, Shift 3, okay. And then we just use this. Let me just run down this way, I think. Right about here. And then we can place lights. We need to automate this the, this light production. That's for sure. Uh, we want a light there. And then another light right there. <clears throat> I want lights along the power lines, just so that way I can kind of use them like roads. That's why, and so the robot should be doing the trick here. Still full, unfortunately. Um, okay, well, as long as it looks like it's doing its thing, it looks like it's enough. So that way it's not backed up, so it's constantly producing. And it is hauling. 
I'm not going up there to recharge looks like, which is unfortunate. They c don't quite make it across. I want to fill this in. So we should actually, so these, so they should be taking these actually all the way down. If we go down over this direction, it's kind of dark here. Let's place a light right here. There we go. I think they changed the lights a little bit in, in point 12, point 10, I think is what a version we're on. So yeah, so I think they kind of changed some stuff that way. Um, I'm just kind of taking a quick peek throughout here. Look at that. I love the system. I love how it just stores things. and ah, It's so wonderful to watch this. Oh, there's lights in here. Let's kind of snag those. Got a splitter from somewhere. I wonder where that came from. Weird. We got just the most random of items. I wonder why. I wonder if it's something to do with the logistics system, the way it, it handles the inventory. I'm not sure how it looks at the you know, these things. Because it would have grabbed it from this, right? Hmm. Very interesting. The stone should be going into this box here, which then goes into this one. Which then gets fed into this one. So landfill. How do we make landfill here? So we need 20 stone. So let's just grab maybe um, 100 stone. Make as much. We can make one bigger landfill. See what that does. Let's run over this way. Let's see if that can reclaim. Where's that pond? Right here. This is where I want to put more, more of these things. More solar cells coming down this way, right? So we need to get rid of these little lake thingies. And so what I figured is we could use this landfill mod and see what we could do. Let's do right. Oh, bang! Game crashed. So we will disable that landfill mod. And we will load our game, which I think will be back to the beginning. So now we need to reset up that silly um, radar unit. So there you go. So that mod probably needs to be updated before I use it, which is unfortunate. Um, but we know where we're going to place this, right? So we can actually start to head that way. Let me buy that tree and that rock. Okay, let's just take this out. Let's take that out. Um, just up a tad. Right about here. Yeah, right here. And we just start all over. Put that there. Put a turret here, 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 right? Then we can put a substation, which has a big area. Then we can put, we can actually, actually, let's not do that. Let's do something better than that. Hmm. Let's do this. Let's position the light, or the lights, I don't have the lights. So we'll make some lamps again. Let's actually make 10 of them. And while that's happening, let's do this again. So I'm just making the wall to have it around this place. Um, it's not necessary. But... It can't, it's not, and it is. If if fighters were to get to here, then at least you have the wall to kind of give you warning, to give you a chance to react to it. So it would definitely allow me to run up here, or just ignore it, knowing full well that I need to, to fix these. So we'll put the light actually in the middle here, like that. And then that way we can hook in this thing like so and now we got a new radar unit we can position the lights in a certain position there we go down here 
Perfect. Okay, we got all this stuff here. This stuff will be dismantled at some point. And then this RoboPort will disappear. So will this one. Because I don't need a RoboPort up here. Um, what will happen is these RoboPorts over here will extend. The, this one will extend towards the right. And we'll replace it over here. So we'll work around this this lake. That's fine. We don't need it. So if that's the case, let us chop down some more trees here just to, so I can expand our our power network here. Let's do this. Um, I have a feeling some of these trees might get in the way. And we can extend this down actually quite far. Let's see here. We still have lots of that stuff. Okay. How far down do you want to extend this? So let's place the substations. That one. Mm. This one. And then this one. We got this one here. <laughs> I hear dogs barking in the background. It's hilarious. This house just never stops. I don't understand. Come and play a decent game here. Erg. <laughs> oh man. That's so funny. So that tells me that steam is being used. Okay, so we need to definitely expand this. Uh, how far down do we want to go? As that is the question. Not too far. Just enough. I think down to here would be enough. Let's... And one more we can... Oh yeah, perfect. So we can actually fit quite a bit of an array in here. And so let us proceed with that. We got s some of these here. Yeah, let's just place it straight down the middle like so. And then do the same with these. Uh, what's going on here? There we go, okay. That's what I expect. Okay. Now we need one more row right here. Let's place that. Okay, and then we have more of the solar panels. And where do those go? Well, they will go basically... Actually, do you want to want? I want to see. <laughs> we have these in the system, I think. Let's take a quick peek here. So we have construction robots, and we have we these should be yeah. We do have passive provider, passive provider. So this is the cool part now. Let's build a blueprint here. <laughs> oh, just you wait. Just you wait. This is why I wanted robots. Oh, yes. We use the blueprint, and we're going to construct the blueprint of the grid we want to create. Like so. And it gives you a preview of it, and bang. This is the blueprint now. Now, with this blueprint, we can simply run over here. And I think that right, uh, shift left click, shift left click will send the order to build. And so that's exactly what I'm doing. Shift left click to build. And watch, they're they're gonna come. They're going to come. It's gonna be amazing. Shift left click. Shift left click. We can actually zoom out for this. I think we can even be out of range. Shift left click. And should take the trees away as well. Let's drop that. Now let's watch. Here's the robots. They're coming. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. I've never seen this in action. Look at all these robots here. Now with that in mind. They're going very slow, so let's speed them up. This is going to burn through the research, but whatever, we need it. We definitely need it, so yeah. 
How's robot production happening? Okay. How many robots do we have? 150, 150. I want more robots. They're all being used. So let's actually just get more logistic. Let's release them out into the wild. Perfect. Construction robots, I think. 65 out of 150. Yeah, okay. Okay. So we'll leave those the way that is. Man, this is so cool. And so then this stuff will produce. We got 96 in there available. How about here? We have 55. Oh, man. Wow, oh, you don't understand. This is so amazing. So I can actually get rid of this stuff. So what we could do is... Oh, they're not actually taking from me. Hmm. They're not actually dumping off everything as quickly as I had anticipated. Let's see here. Let's throw in here. Um, I'm just throwing my woods. Okay, let's get rid of those. Let's throw in. Uh, is there a spot for copper wire? Hmm. Take a quick peek on that. Copper wire. So I don't have a chest requesting copper wire anywhere. So, what we could do is we could request the copper wire here just for, ah, nah, you know what, it's not even worth it. We'll just dump it in here. <laughs> yeah, okay. What else can we throw into our garbage slots here? Um, iron chest we can break down, actually, which that's what's going to happen here. <clears throat> now we got this thing, iron chest. This is so amazing, this logistic stuff. Man. You're are able to manage the inventory now more, more efficiently, right? So that alone makes that cool. Why are they taking my bullets? Do they not like the bullets? Hmm. How many logistic robots? We have zero out of 200. Hmm. I'm going to wait till that gets to 50 before I release more. So there you go. Logistic robot speed is increased. Personal robot port. This is, this is a really cool toy. And it's not really useful to us until we have the best power armor, really, because it, it uses a lot of energy. We need enough reactors to run the damn thing. So we would need... I think uh, power armor 2, <clears throat> this is what we need because this one gives you 10 by 10 grid. This one gives you 7 by 7 grid, right? 7 by 7 grid size. This thing uses 4 by 4. So for, actually, we could probably <clears throat> upgrade to this power armor now. Yeah, and then we can build it. To heck with it. And then we can get a, a fusion reactor going. Um, I think I already built one, maybe? Or let's take a quick peek. Um, how can I look in, my in the logistics system? What's the... How do I do that? Um, do we even have to mouse over? Ah, here we go. Okay, so we have... Bullets, stone, pair packs, plates, um, bullets, let's see, wood, uh, do, 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 but do we not see w what we need? Hmm. We'll let the research go through. I thought I could build the reactor now. I see the solar panel. Um, did I not research it? Or does it need to be crafted inside 
one of these guys. Um, let's check that. I actually have these, these originals. Um, let me turn this into a requester chest. Uh, where are we? We need a requester chest. Which is this one. Okay. Um, no, okay, requester chest. Okay, so this requester chest can be this thing, right? And then, limit the inventory part manipulated by machines. Oh, that's a new new thing. So I think we can have a logistics for this stuff, make it 100. So that way we have two stacks, right? So what I want to do is I want to basically then use my trash slots. Let's, let's keep the bullets. I'll use my trash slots and basically um, have them pick them up and throw them in here. So I just want to see this in action. It's robots, where are you? Hello, hello. And where are we here? We need robots. Um, <clears throat> where, where are you, my robots? Here we go, in here. Now, here we go. Yeah, okay, so you need to use... I see. So we need to use this thing. So, for example... Yeah, here we go. Now we got more options up here. So we have... Where's robots? I don't see robots in here. Oh, here we go. Okay. Um, I don't see a fusion reactor. There we go. Now we just we just need artifacts. So, so we need twenty electric engine units. All right. Then we need ten alien artifacts. We should be able to call them. All right. And uh, then we have everything else currently. That's cool. Very cool. Now let's see. These guys should take those, I hope. Or someone. Hello, robots. They're a little bit faster now, if you notice. How's the research coming along? Um, it's a request your chest, but I should be able to get them. Guys, I hope so. It should be considered in the logistics system, right? Um, I wish you could scroll up and down that list of stuff. Uh, where is it? There's... <clears throat> Let's see here. Hmm. Yeah, looks like we have a shortage of stuff. Why isn't it bringing me those? It's like I don't have enough robots. Because... You should be able to pull it out of these, no? Hmm. Might have to change this up. Might have to put in... Let's see here. You want to put in a pass it provides con to requesters construction and player. Okay. You want passive provider, <clears throat> and then we want let's delimit that, and then we can put in the requester chest. And uh, this is the 24,000. 24,000. Okay. And 
Now let us throw this, this, and build one of these. Throw that in there. And we need power, I think. Like so. Deliver. Filters, deliver. Well, that looks like they're going to come and pick up this stuff now. That's a lot of pieces to pick up, actually. Yeah, see, there you go. Now it's working. But why isn't it delivering the... Um, hmm. <clears throat> Let's go back over here. It's not taking my stuff. It's not taking it. Um... Hmm. Okay, um... Oh, no, shit. Ah. We do want requester. Let's put those there for now. We did uh, that, and then we where is it? Here it is. She always have a hundred in here. Yeah, that might be too much now, but whatever. Too late. And we got the the fifty that are here. Perfect. Let's pick this guy up. Now we can continue with this. Where is it? Let's replace these buggers everywhere. Because that's what I want to do. Let's do that. Because we get easily distracted here in Factorio. <laughs> so I think we come to the conclusion I need this thing. We haven't. Ah, oh, these are what I have to research. Never mind, I'm looking at this wrong. Okay, so we will research this. Let's actually. Hmm. Does night vision. Personal laser defense. Energy shield mark 2. Logistics. Logistic robot cargo size. We would need that. And let's place some more of these. We're going to be burning through resources, I think. We need to kind of think about circuit production, how we can increase that. Because I think that is a bottleneck. Um, what else is there? I'm just trying to think here. We got some more of these dudes, which we need to re release into the wild. Uh, how many more can we place of these? Okay. Um, Look at that, there's a couple blue here. I think that's all of them. Yeah, I think that's all of them. We should only have the gold ones now. Uh, let's place these in here. Ah, it looks like they are going to deliver it. Sweet! I just wish there was a way of limiting this. Um, smart inserter. Um, okay. So if there's less than, um, so what's this for again? We are. <clears throat> blue crafting less than 50 Okay, so we should be able to do this. 
damage. I should be able to keep this logistics down to 50. Yeah, no, that's good. Now it's taking the alien packs, which is good. And did I not finish the suit? Oh, I did finish the suit. Don't know why I have more alien packs, but... Power armor, there we go. So now we have some new armor, so let us right click on this. Let's unequip all this stuff. Okay, uh, bang, 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 bang. Oh, pick those up, put those there. Perfect. Now let's exchange it here. Right click the power armor. Oh, bang, look at that. Look at that. We need to research the reactors. So, what do we need to make the cool stuff? Or do I need that? Can I just do it all from my pocket? Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. So we'll have to load this up, take a quick peek in it. Um, I don't have Mark II's, maybe. I thought I had Mark II shields. I think I have to research it. Okay. No problem. Um, it gave me the suit, but it gave me the resources back from it. Like, notice I have the 20 electric engines. And I had 10. And it gave me... That's so weird. Did you see that? And I have my power armor. So that is a bug. So it's not... <laughs> that's so funny. That's still in the game. Uh, that's amusing. Okay. So what am I waiting for? I'm waiting for this logistic robot cargo size. And so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. is Off camera, I'm going to research the portable fusion reactor. And I'm going to build it. I'm going to set up my suit. The way I, I, I'd like it. And then when I come back with the next episode, I think we're going to go after and secure this oil up here and set up production. We're going to do it up here as well. And then I think we'll, we'll create an oil train that goes up from to, to pick up oil in these two spots here and come back. I kind of want to do a train. I haven't really done a train. This would be, I think, perfect opportunity to create a system, a double track system for that so yeah so thank you everybody for watching hope you've enjoyed yourselves and i look forward to seeing you in the next episode bye bye